what an evening this is what's up guys how's it going hope you like my hair if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe hit notifications because actually only 30 percent of you guys are subscribed so i was looking at my stats the other day and it's like yeah 60 or 70 percent unsubscribed or not subscribed and just uh come to view so anyways today i worked all day that's why my hair is just grease right now and they wanted to smash some things out uh, before, you know, I do computer work. So the bike, I feel like I haven't ridden her much this year, but uh, she's getting new graphics. So I think I've had these on for two years now. They're pretty scuffed up. Little chunks coming off here, you know, basically from where the boot rubs, right? So I'm going to go wash it, rip all these off, do a time lapse, put some fresh ones on. Should take me a few hours. I don't know. I haven't done it in a while, but should be quicker than doing the Maverick graphics. So let's head over, we'll go wash it, get her looking fresh again. Let's go. Oh man, these stickers are not coming off easy. I don't remember them being this hard to take off. Maybe they used better glue on the last kit. So anyways, yes, yeah, it's just a stock 450 underneath. Look at that, wow. It's amazing what a few stickers will do. So I got half done. Well, that side at least. Um, yeah, some of them came off easy, some kind of tore. That one wasn't fun, surprisingly, but I got it off, so. Let's uh, start on the other side and see if we can get them all off here. She is wrapless. That's her. This is the freshy wrap. Not too much of a difference. Got darker 408, Freeman's up top. Got some Carhartt. All the fun stuff. Altine LTD, there's some mini number plates. So, I can't find, once we did the whole garage clean out, I had a spare number plate for it so i think we're doing a photo shoot tomorrow night with this in the pool so i'm gonna leave this on for now the bike's just gonna be sitting sideways anyway so you only see the side profile of it so and then i'll just buy a new front number plate for the snowmobile show take this one off hang it up on the wall with the old guest plate and all my quad stuff so all right let's start applying graphics and hopefully this doesn't take too long because i'm ready for bid Done. Oh, really? That took a minute. It was actually a lot harder to just take the stickers off this time. I think I just heat gunned the last ones on too hard and they like glued themselves to it. But anyways, got them off, got the new ones on. They look amazing. They actually went on super fast. It only took me, I'd say just over an hour. So got the Rockstar, the LTD, the Lime 9. Got some Carhartt going on here. So if you guys want the most amazing graphics, 
Lime Nine's your guy. There's a link below. He'll hook you up. Obviously, you can't get the exact same as these because these are custom for my bike, but uh, I'm sure you can do a similar to design. Throw your sponsors on there. So the only thing I didn't rip off was my number plate. I got a new number plate going or coming. So I'll swap that out and then this is the one that's supposed to be on there. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> we'll just run it like that. So bike looks sick. Hope you guys are happy. I'm sure happy. It's done. It's over with. I'll probably do for a new bike soon. I'll probably run this one for a little longer. I don't ride a ton anyways, so. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm glad I got the new graphics on. Um, I hope to see you guys at the Toronto Snowmobile and ATV show. Uh, it's like October 25th, I believe. So I'll be there. Eric will be there. Brennan from Gold Rush will be there. We'll be at the Team LTD booth all weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, in and out. So come by, say hi, grab some posters. We'll have posters, stickers, merch, everything you want, everything you need. So thank you guys again. Have a fantastic day. I'm so tired. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you later. Bye, guys.